Okay, hi everyone. So today let's uh, discuss this interesting problem. So it says a wheel of mass uh, 10 kg and uh, radius 20 cm is rotating at an angular speed of 100 revolution per minute. When the motor is turned off, neglecting the friction at the axle, calculate the force that must be applied tangentially to the wheel to bring it to rest in 10 revolutions. Fine. So this way we have a wheel. Uh, radius is given and mass is also given. Radius is 1 by 5 meter and mass is 10 kilogram right initially it was uh, moving it was rotating with 100 revolution per minute 100 revolution means 2 pi radian and per minute means 60 seconds so this is the initial value of angular velocity now we want uh, this wheel to come to rest in 10 revolutions means after rotating an angle of 10 into 2 pi radian it will finally come to rest so for that we have to apply a force on this wheel tangential direction let's say we are applying a force capital F right on this wheel in the tangential direction so is capital F ka value hume find out karna hai so dekho is problem ko karne ke hamare paas do method hai let's say method one is by using work energy theorem in rotational kinematics it says that work done by all the torques is equal to change in rotational kinetic energy of the wheel uh, delta k right uh, now कितने टॉर्क लगेंगे इस व्हील पे देखो हम मोटर बंद कर देंगे एंड फ्रिक्शन को इग्नोर करना है सिर्फ एक ही टॉर्क होगा इस कैपिटल एफ का कितना टॉर्क होगा दैट विल बी टॉर्क इज इक्वल टू एफ इनटू आर बिकॉज़ ये टेंजेंशियली एक्ट कर रहा है राइट दिस इज द वैल्यू ऑफ टॉर्क और जब ये व्हील uh, कितना रोटेट करेगा यू कैन सी 20 पाई uh, 20 पाई रेडियन रोटेट करेगा सो व्हाट विल बी द वर्क डन दैट विल बी एफ इनटू आर टॉर्क इनटू थीटा दैट इज uh, 20 pi इस तरह से uh, let's write it theta बाद में values put कर देंगे that is equal to change in kinetic energy that is half of i into omega final square minus omega initial square right this is a change in rotational kinetic energy so यहाँ से f का value कितना आएगा i upon 2 theta r omega final square minus omega initial square now i का value क्या होगा moment of inertia that is that is simply m r square by 2 so ये 4 हो गया now everything is given m का value दे रखा है r का value दे रखा है theta का value दे रखा है omega final will be 0 finally it will come to rest and omega initial भी दे रखा है uh, initial angular velocity right ये रही so just put the values and you will get the answer right uh, method 2 की बात करें that is simple by kinematics किस तरह से करना है हम एक force लगा रहे इस wheel पे in the tangential direction capital F right so what will be the angular acceleration that is f upon i uh, sorry torque upon i hoga na torque upon i will be the value of angular acceleration now what is torque torque is f into r that is force we are applying into r sirf ek hi torque lagega so this is the value of angular acceleration now you can use this equation omega final square minus initial omega square that is equal to 2 into alpha into theta right now alpha ka value aap put karoge f r upon i so yahan se bhi same equation nikal ke aayega f ka value find out karo i upon 2 theta r into omega final square minus initial omega square right again you are getting the same equation check karo upar bhi humne isi tarah ka equation likha tha i ke terms mein right so by putting the values you can find the answer so i think you have understood let me know if you still have any confusion we can discuss further Okay guys, keep working hard. Best of luck. Bye.